Say something in your mic. Something in my mic. Something in your mic. Something in my mic, which Absolutely. would be weird if there was somebody named Michael in front of me. Hey, we'll go back to our Steve with Rex. It's Tim Corbett. I'm Mike. And you can follow us on Instagram, Twitter for more <laughs> juicy content. Thank you to everybody who supports us on Patreon. Follow us on Twitter, yes. Twitter account. Subscribe if you haven't hit the like button. Please. Yeah. Because Do it. It helps the algorithm. It does. And that's what we all want. It, world peace and uh, gay rights, you know, or, uh, end world hunger is fine, but we want to help the algorithm more than anything. More than anything in the world. Yeah. Yeah. Um,. Happy Pride Month, by the way. That's right. Happy Pride Month. Uh, they're, they're celebrating Pride Month with full vigor at North Hollywood Elementary. Have you seen that? No. What do they do? Oh, cr people are protesting because, oh, because they want to have an assembly this Friday celebrating Pride Month. And so there's people burning pride flags. So they bought the pride flag and now yeah. they're burning it. Yeah, they bought it, gave money to them, and then real, real burnt it. Yeah. Real well, most people on that side <laughs> are really anyway, highly intelligent. Today we're doing a movie review <laughs> of the film that came out last year. We wanted to see it in theaters, uh, but obviously it was, I think it was here for like a week or something. An hour. Uh, it, it wasn't here for very long at all. And it was at a theater um, that was... 900 minutes away from us. I don't remember where exactly I, I don't it was. But it, 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 this had a long wait of, because it came out, I think, November of last year, I want to say. Uh, uh, yeah, it, that but, feels but it right. Just came to OTT. Right. Like That's a long time. Python was in January. It's right. already on it's, OTT. It's, on, it's cause it, it, it varies. It's yeah. crazy. It's just very strange. Um, regardless. Uh, but it just came out, so uh, we heard a lot about it, obviously. Uh, I think it's from the same makers as Street. It is. Um, yep. Look at yeah. my notes. A, a huge uh, number of the creative team yeah. are there from, from Street. Street. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's no spoilers. It's just you've got uh, the, the, the director, you've got the writer, yeah. you've got the, per, the, the score. Starring... Uh, a dose and a couple uh, others who are not yes, dose. Hopefully, yes. future dose. Yep. Uh, in Varun and Creedy. Yep. And, and our and Abhishek. Abhishek. Uh, did he cast it? He, he did. did. He of was course. part of the casting team, oh. of course. I don't know if he. I wonder if he does anything now that he doesn't cast. Do you think he does? He probably does. I'm sure he would. Yeah, you think for so? sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Regardless. Absolutely. Um, but it, this did come out last year, uh, so it, we're going to do a, a, a spoiler review just because I, I. We. we it, it, it came out a while ago. Right, or do you want to do a non-spoiler? Let's just to be safe. Okay, all right. Let's do a non-spoiler, and I'll, I'll explain why I think we should do non-spoiler gotcha. at the front. In a I, I think I know why. Yeah. Um, but anyway, it's on Geo app, which is not available in the United States. Uh, we saw it in a, a different way, but it's on a Geo app, which makes me nervous because Bloody Daddy is coming out on Geo yeah. uh, app. So uh, we'll see well, how we just can. Ask, he's your best friend. Just ask him. For I'll see. I'll get a screen a copy, or yeah. something. Uh, whatever whatever exactly. I can do. Anyways, but. Uh, if you haven't watched it, go watch it, come back. But this is going to be our little non-spoiler non -spoiler review front. first. And then before we get into spoilers, we'll get into it later. But it's a comedy, horror, thriller kind right. of thing. Right, right. Um, and it's basically a werewolf. Uh, it's not right. a spoiler. That's you not a spoiler. It it's in the trailer, right. Um, kind of thing. So, Rick, your initial thoughts. This is why I would like to have a non-spoiler front. If I didn't like the movie, I wouldn't care. Yeah. But I liked the movie. Yeah. So I don't want to ruin it for people. I understand. Um, I... I th I thought it not only was uh, a lot of fun. Yeah. I not only thought it was really funny. Yeah. I thought um, oh, that's uh, a specific line. That yeah, I, I mean, as, <laughs> and as the one thing, if you have not seen it, just please be forgiving of a team that I think did everything they possibly CGI. could yeah. with the CGI. And there's just so much you can do if you don't have the time and the money, which. Like if they hey, had Brahmastra budget, I'm sure. Yeah, better, and it right? just it's it's just it's a shame because I I uh, applauding to this movie is very dependent on CGI, and sometimes yeah. the CGI was actually quite good. Yeah, and there's other times it's <laughs> yeah. just yeah bad. Yeah, but yeah, yeah. You're rooting for it the whole time, so yeah. I ultimately and I really liked it. Uh, I enjoyed it as well. Uh, it's it's just a it's a fun, it's fun. movie so from the With from the heart. same makers of Street. I I think got a little message. I don't. I think I did a little disservice because I thought it was going to be a very similar style to Street. Right, and it's, it's not it's, as good. It's not. It's not as good as Street, and it's a different style. If Street is a a hundred to ninety five, this is going to be more of an eighty for me. Yeah, um, I give it. I, I'm a little, a little higher. I give it an 83.9. 83. 83. Nice. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but 
it, it's also it, a different style. It, it is. It's, it, a, it's actually almost a superhero and, it's, style. And it's very original. If yeah. you stick with it, it feels like it's going to be this campy, what you expect, silliness. But then it actually has, it attempts with sincerity. It's not heavy handed. It's a real difficult accomplishment to take a film like this and, and also have in it some heart and a, a serious message and a really nice twist. This is not a spoiler, but I think you're going to be pleasantly surprised at directions you think this is going to go because I've not seen a werewolf movie that is quite like this one. Twilight? I've never seen Twilight. <laughs> Right. The, I, it was actually funny. We were watching it. She's like, "This is." She was talking about the CGI. She's like, "This is what I imagine Twilight is." Because <laughs> I was like, "Well, funny thing is that came out like 15 years yeah, ago." A, a really great. So the visual effects that I'm about to refer to are, are extraordinarily dated, but boy, were they good in the day, and they're fun and campy now. If you haven't seen an American Werewolf in London, I've never actually seen that movie. It's a fun. Yeah, I've never seen that movie. Fun. It's so dated, but the transformation was at the time groundbreaking. By today's standards, it's like when you used to watch yeah. the old movies from the 1950s. So. Uh, but I, let's talk about uh, uh, let's talk about the lead first. Uh, Varun, yeah. I thought he did a very good job. He, he bulked up like crazy. Uh, he's a good job yeah. on the... Uh, I know that probably was not a, a difficult um, time to be at that mass level. Yeah. Probably eating just raw... Like, Must have sucked. Like bland just chicken. boiled for... <laughs> chicken and rice. And... <laughs> Must have been terrible oh. for a long time. Um, but he did it, and so shout shout out to you. I thought this was actually a very good performance. I, mean, I did it, too. It's not that it needed to be like this an amazing performance or anything, but you could also give a bad performance. Yeah, it could have uh, really screwed it up, and there's a lot of... Not just in the fact that he had to transform, but there's a lot of demand on him physically yeah. throughout the film. Yeah, he did actually a trans like the the first time. It's once again not a spoiler. He does transform into a what? werewolf. Yeah, it's you know that it's from the trailer. Uh, the first time he did it, I actually thought like the, what they made him because he had to do all these. This I know kind of movements. Long, I thought he did a very good job. The the you'll see again not a spoiler. He does transform, but it it's quite impressive. You're anticipating the takeover of makeup and v, VFX. And it's not. It's just him contorting yeah. and yeah. gyro. So yeah, the demand on him physically. He, I saw him fully invested. Yeah. in this. I thought I, I thought he did as well. Me I thought too. He did a very good job. Yeah. Uh, I love Creedy. Creedy's oh, always good. Uh, she's like I don't think she can give a bad performance. Um, she's just she, she's such a yeah. Fun, she's wonderful. Endearing actor as well. Agreed. I thought she did a good job. I thought they had uh, some good chemistry. Yeah. I thought. Almost all the comedy came from, uh, not all the comedy, but a lot of the comedy came it's, from Abhishek. A lot of it. Um, just from, At least half. From his reactions yeah, yeah, yeah. to things. At least and, half. Uh, Thankfully, because just, he, he... Just like in Street, yeah. uh, as well, he, he gave a lot of the comedy there. But I thought the friend as well. Uh, the, yes. Uh, what, uh, their, their buddy is, is a Palin Kabak, if you pronounce that correctly, who played uh, Joman, their buddy. The, okay. Oh, he doesn't even have a picture. Well, you know why? Uh, is it first time? It's his first film. He has no credits. Another great thing. He did a great job. Another great thing about this is the Northeastern representation yeah. of this movie. It's huge. They like More than half the cast uh, was Northeastern. Yep. Um, and I don't know if they were speaking Northeastern at all or if it was predominantly I, Hindi. Uh, yeah. But they, they made some references sometimes. And so I can't pick up on that, though. No, and purposefully, again, not a spoiler, but, but, but there are those moments. It's wonderful where when they're speaking in whatever language they are, because it is not Hindi, you're left as the audience as uh, unsure of what's being said as the other characters in the story because they don't give you subs. Yeah. You have to wait for the translation, so yeah. you're also listening and wondering what's being said. Uh, I thought the... Uh, it wasn't as... Once again, I think I did it a service because I was going in expecting more of Stree in terms of like also horror elements mm. and uh, overall comedy, which I think Stree does better at both. Yeah. Um, and because there's not a ton of horror in this. No, and it's interesting. As there was some in Stree. But so witches are scarier than werewolves. Yes, they are. <laughs> they are. I, I, I'm actually surprised that I did not do that, um, mm. that I did not go in, even though I knew this was from the same creators and part of, yeah. you know, uh, I, I, I remember watching it. And there was a point very early on where I just said, okay, so you're going to be this. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I, I let it too. It's just I I think I, I was I was had more of an expectation of Street, And I think you should just go in with 
and no expectation. G- the expectation, and then we'll go it's into bad the spoilers. To compare, it's, ba- it's always bad to compare a movie to uh, another, another great one. movie. Uh, true. Because, <laughs> no. especially if it's one that you love a lot. It's, it's, correct. It's, it's unfair to the movie. But I, I, the ultimate takeaway from this is I, I think this is worth watching. Oh, easily. I know you do, easy. too. I think you'll have a really good time. I think you'll laugh a lot and probably even more than we did, and I laughed a lot. Oh, yeah, especially with the dialect. Yes, stuff, yeah. and plays on words, yeah. and um, the performances are all solid by the whole cast. And again, you'll find, and we'll talk about this in the spoiler section, I think you're going to find that this is a, a, a film that really tries to also send a positive yeah. message and has some heart. I agree with you. Yeah. Uh, so if you haven't watched it, please go watch it. Please Come back. Watch We're going to get into some spoilers now because there's a bunch we could talk Time about. Time to get spoiled. Do not mm. watch if yeah. you haven't watched. Oh, yeah. Do we not like continue to watch it if you haven't seen the movie yet. Because mm. yeah, there are some major spoilers. Huge. If you've uh, not seen this, it's going to be ruined for you and you should let the movie tell the story. Yes. Uh, and uh, stay till you've the You've been warned. Very end. Okay. Uh, <laughs> uh, How many uh, things did you like about the twists and turns at the well, end? Well, actually... Um, did you... F- uh, you usually predict. Well, are things. you talking about Creedy? Creedy. Did oh, you know that? We called that way. Yeah, I did not. We called that. Like, I did. I love my naivete. We called I it. I love like, it. Very early when she came on. That must suck. Uh, <laughs> because I get well, those surprise. It's like finding out what you're going to get for Christmas well, before it, Christmas morning. Here's the, here's the reason it's it's easy in this one, especially because the beginning part that the story with the whatever that guy whether with, it was yeah, her dad or yeah. not. We were trying to figure out who that girl is. Right. And so the, immediately when the first girl came up, we're like. I bet she's a werewolf. Lou, I just, <laughs> that must suck because I didn't see it coming. When you she didn't see it coming at no, all, I had a oh, double wow. bonus prize. That's, I had a prize. Within that's the more prize. fun. Yeah, that's the more prize fun. I had was, oh, it's her. That's cool. And then she said, "I've been doing this for a few hundred years." And they flash back to her, and I went, "Double cool." <laughs> Nice. So me being stupid really yeah. came in handy. No, yeah, we called that one early on, <laughs> uh, uh, which is it's still funny. I did not enjoy it still, um, but yeah, she did a, a great job. That twist was 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 fun. I like the whole message of you know conserving nature. Absolutely, which, which is you're not wonderful. worthy. Uh, you're not worthy to be an animal. It was exactly. a great line. As is the whole twist on the fact that the wolves are not the antagonist. They're actually the heroes trying to preserve the natural world. Yeah, I thought that was wonderful. Uh, we talked about the CGI. There's one scene I want to talk about specifically, though, and I just didn't understand why. Okay. When she took him to her spot right. on, on the top of the hill. Yeah. India has countless of beautiful views. Yes. Why CGI that? In- they were in a studio. I think. <laughs> why? I, I think. Like, in India, in Northeast specifically. I know. I they know. have this in the entire country of this gorgeous beauty that we've seen. I that know. I can almost guarantee you will probably be even prettier than what they made. Agreed. I don't understand why they didn't just do it live. <laughs> I, I think for two reasons. It didn't even make the, sense. The first was. They did that in full studio. Having to go to a location for just the one shot. You, you think that would be less expensive than going to a location like that? They probably didn't even have to pay well, for Well, I think that's the second part, which could have been solvable. But you, you did notice when w- after she falls and we go to that ending shot before credits. And obviously there's the post credits. Yeah. Uh, but did you notice the shape of the mountain they were on? Is it a wolf? Yeah, it's a yeah. wolf face. Yeah. So they had to create that, which obviously they could yeah, have done. But I, th- I, done, yeah. I think the amount of scouting time to get it to be exactly what yeah. they wanted, and then go to the location for just it was, it was single just, shot. The, the question the, it we're was already just, using CGI. Let's just yeah, green screen it. But it was already it was like so jarring because it wasn't like good CGI. Yeah. That entire thing was like. I mean, if you had Avatar money, sure, do it. Obviously, but that's already so much. I'm serious. But it was just like, it, no, it didn't ruin it. It was just yeah. like, I didn't understand. I was like, you're in India. You're in the Northeast <laughs> India. I'm sure there's a billion places that had this beautiful view. True. That wouldn't have been like, oh, wow, that's a lot of CGI. <laughs> <laughs> but you're already using CGI. Yeah, yeah, so I just give it. them another assignment. I did think that a lot of times, especially with the wolves, they spent a lot of their money on the the wolf specifically. Not when they're running, because <laughs> when they're running, it's pretty bad. Right. Yeah. But like on the close ups, close up I thought they shots. did a good job. At, 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 they spent their too. money there, you could tell. The other the other one they did, I thought one of the best CGIs was when he walks in to see the guy that he had previously attacked who's laying on the bed. Yeah. He's laying there with all the marks on him. And my first thought, I said it out loud, was I went, nice makeup. Mm-hmm. And then it shifted and I went, oh, you, you've you tricked me, you guys. Good job, CGI team. Yeah. Because the makeup was all, all computer and generated. The, the, the guy got great his job. arm ripped off, yes. which was great. I love that. <laughs> I, I feel... 
I feel like the whole creative team wishes they could just scream to the rafters and shout from every mountain, guys, we did the best we could with the time and the money we had. If we had been given Marvel yeah. money and time, oh, yeah. this would have knocked your socks off. Yeah, easily. Yeah. Uh, and, and you know why. It's just, it's always jarring when there's... It is. When the wolf's running and he lo- it just and, looks real bad. <laughs> it's know. like... <laughs> uh, you know, it Bless happens. Their hearts. Like, luckily, that's not the, the meat and potatoes of the movie. No, um, no. And that was, that was given. Let's talk about um, the thing that... It was it was kind of spoiled. I was expecting it because I was told it's in the same universe as Stree. Right. And so, but when it ended and the credits rolled, I was like, where was Stree? Why does everybody say I mean, Abhishek's there? Well, that but was why- the only thing I was thinking about was because the name of his character is the same name of the character in Stree. So I thought, okay. Hey, I guess that's is it. Is this prequel? Yeah. Is this side story? Is yeah. Is that... It? Yeah, that's what I was like. And the credits rolled, and I was like, okay. Well, and Steph's like, I didn't see a one street in this entire thing. Right. And then it happened. Benod shows up. <laughs> <laughs> was it weird? It was weird. Because that's how I, that's what I've got him in my head as. Obviously, we just watched Jubilee. Just like, watched just Jubilee. now. And obviously, I knew he was from Street, and that's where we knew him. But he showed up, and I was like, that's Benod. Exactly. <laughs> Why is Benod Why is Benod here? here? And, and is he going to do a play with these guys? Raj Kumar's now this buff, yeah. like, ridiculous. Like, he's so much bigger than he was in Street. Right. Uh, <laughs> but they showed up, and that entire scene was so funny. It was great. And, and, like, the same character. It's Because they're doing Street 2. They, they've already announced it. Right. It's it. all. whole team uh, is connected. And so that's super exciting yeah. to, uh, to see that. But I love the whole tie into the universe and i don't know if they're gonna make another like obviously i'm sure in now street 2 the uh um varun's character i'm sure yes. is gonna show up now oh, if they're trying to connect it please absolutely um, should and since the success of this and the, the, the i'm sure they're gonna be expecting street 2 to make some money absolutely that um but that one wasn't that heavily relying on cgi as this one was no not at all outside of the witch when she came up and, and it was so subtle and small this yeah. was this was a hundred times more cgi dependent yeah that one was a lot more horror even though it wasn't like scary scary but it was a lot more horror centric and funnier yeah and even though this is i, I want to talk about the what, what? The, the breaking bad <laughs> i know <laughs> I wrote it down. I loved it. I put I, it right here. I, I am the danger. I am the one who knocks people out. I loved it. I laughed out loud. I did too, and I wrote it down. I wrote, thank you for the Breaking Bad tip of the oh, hat right that there. That was so funny. Was. I wasn't expecting it. Not at all. It was, was brilliant. Well, at first, I saw, he said, I am the danger. I'm like, oh, what? that's ridiculously close. And then he said, I, I am I'm not. Okay, good. <laughs> it was so funny. Thank you, Heisenberg. So oh, funny. It was great. And, but a lot of the other comedy came from the Abhishek's characters and just like it, he, him and Stree. Yeah. He's such a good... And play on words, like the play on the word lemon. He's such um, a great casting director, but he's also a great actor. <laughs> screaming and, mommy in the backseat. <laughs> he, because he could play... Remember him in... Um, yes. Uh, Patalok. Patalok. Oh, the madman. And how amazing at dramatic he was. He's great. And then he's so fucking funny. Yeah. Like he is the all around... He's like, there's so many of those actors around that they always are the supporting characters, but are usually stronger actors than a lot of the the leading actors. True, and it it's why because he knows acting, it's why he also anything you see him attached to in casting. I, I don't think there's a thing we've ever seen that has him on the casting team or the primary casting director, where the actors aren't superlative. Yeah. He just he knows acting both he does. how to how to do it and how to recognize it. Yeah, yeah. Um, the uh, it's, I did think sometimes it, it just comes with the territory. Sometimes uh, with with uh, Hindi movies or Indian movies in general, I did think it was overscored a little bit. Uh, it, it was overscored, and but it was like they were they did a lot of like I said. This is more instead of horror um, um, comedy. This is almost superhero, they, right? They and they put superhero music very much over so. him, very much. Uh, so. It was like he was essentially once again spoilers. You shouldn't be here if you haven't seen it. He was almost Spider Man. Very much. Right? Yeah, very much. The, the character? Yeah. But yeah, I, I did think, not all the times, but I did think of those and, times that I thought it was a little overshadowed. You may feel this way as well. I, I'm, I'm far more 
accepting of overscoring in a film like this. Comedy-ish. Yeah, yeah, because so much is over the top, playing for the laugh, being an entertainer. Its primary objective is not to be something where they're looking for deep believability and there's going to be a powerful moral to the story and it has an important message they want to leave you with and it's going on the film festival circuit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Overscoring there is unforgivable because it detracts from the reality of what you're seeing. Yeah. Whereas with this, the score is part of the overall value and the laughter. Yeah. That's why they can do something silly and go <laughs> with the music and you love it. Yeah. But I, it was a mix because at times it I, it was a little overscored. It didn't bother me because of what I just said. Yeah. And then there were a couple of moments. It was really wonderful. Yeah, yeah it was. Yeah. Um, and it's, and by the way, Family Man, every episode, same composer. Really? Yeah, I looked up <clears> the credits on <throat> that. That's interesting. Quite a few things. Hindi Medium, Stree, obviously. Mm-hmm. Bad Lepur, Okay. And Family Man. The other thing I wanted to mention was the the the, the actor who plays Panda. They're uh, the other guy. So there's the three main guys, and then they had the yeah. other guy who knows the villagers and Pan- stuff. We know him. We know. It's wild. Hindi Medium. That's what it was. Hindi Medium. He's so good at Hindi he Medium. He was in Hindi Medium. Omkara. He was in Omkara, McBool, yeah. Gulal. And yeah. here's what I love about some of the credits for the director. He's a great director. He's a great actor. The, the, the director, yeah, he did a great job in this, but 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 uh, Amar Koshik not only is director, but he has a couple of s- screen credits in films he's directed. So in Stree, he plays Homeless Stud. <laughs> and he's in uh, he's an AD in No One Killed Jessica. Okay. He's an AD, but he's also stud in car. Stud in so car. So it, it may be contractual that any credit he has, he's got to be stud. Stud. Yeah. Um, so yeah, I, I, I really enjoyed this film, and I'm glad I did, because obviously it's it did so well, uh, and uh, I, I got recommended it a lot, obviously. Thankfully. Uh, I, like I said, I wanted to go see this when it was in theaters. It just was here for a very short amount of time. A, I don't I, I don't even remember if it was one that was near us. Um, there was a reason we didn't go. I don't remember what it was. But um, I wanted to see it in theaters because we, we liked the trailer. Yeah. We liked Shri. Um, but I'm we glad... Like 3D, it, we yeah, like We I, like him. I'm, I'm glad it did, did well. Uh, and and it, another thing that's... As I think about it, I, I'm really surprised that it felt the way it did at a two and a half hour run, run time. Yeah, two... 220. Yeah. Was, yeah. With, I mean, the end credits, sometimes when a movie's too long, the end credits come up and you're looking at the clock going, okay, come on. Not with this one. Yeah. I, I stayed, I watched through the whole, did you, oh, yeah. the musical number? Yeah. You saw who came in in the musical yeah. number with Creedy? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so much fun. Yeah. Uh, yeah, Stay. definitely stay for the credits for this one. Yeah. Uh, we reacted to that song, didn't we? If we did, I forgot that there's, I forgot who pairs up with Creedy. I thought we, I thought we we we, we may have, but I thankfully uh, block, blocked it out or something. <laughs> uh, it was a while, and maybe it was it never it was never released. I thought I, maybe I'm mistaken. Um, anyways, yeah, I had a lot of fun with this one. Yep. Um, let us know what you thought about this film. Uh, if you liked it, I'm very excited for Street Two. And anything we missed? Uh, is when is Street One coming out? You, Street One already came out. It did. Yeah. Uh, Street 2. I think they're pre-production. Street 2? Yeah, it says production unknown. I'm sure... 2024. Yeah, I'm sure it's scheduling. Next year. The the, the people involved, it's a matter of getting everybody's schedule together because <laughs> they're connected to so many projects. Yeah, I'm only going to see Benod now with... Uh... <laughs> I know. I love it. <laughs> he showed up and was like, why is Benod here? It did. <laughs> it did. It made me. It made me go. Wah, wah. <laughs> what universe are we in? Exactly. No, he's gonna kill you. Uh, anyways, uh, let us know what you thought about this movie uh, and what should be the next film we watch down below.